we've got in the denominator 1 minus 2 over x minus 5. So we can combine those if we had a common denominator. So in that denominator, 1 is the same thing as x minus 5 divided by x minus 5, right? Anything divided by itself is 1. And so it would be that minus 2 over x minus 5. And now we can combine these. We get x minus 5 minus 2, which is really just x minus 7 divided by x minus 5. And remember, that was the original denominator. And so in the numerator, we still have that 3 over x minus 5. So let's try to squeeze that in. And now we've just got this division problem. And remember, when we divide two fractions, we can do keep, change, flip, if you've heard it described like that before, where we keep the original numerator, we change the division to multiplication, and we flip the bottom fraction, aka we need the reciprocal. And so this is the same thing as dividing by that fraction. If we multiply by the reciprocal, and watch what happens. This cancels with this on top and bottom, and we're left with our answer, which is just 3 over x minus 7, which is d.